Okay, not bad. Not bad. Okay, viewers, welcome. Bobby Brown, um, guns and drums. And that wasn't too bad a shooting, uh, even if it was just from seven and a half yards with my long barreled high standard. This is the Longhorn Convertible. It is a nine and a half inch barrel on an aluminum frame. Um, I'll take you off here. Bear with me just for a second here. Uh, it is a nine and a half inch barrel on an aluminum frame. And it is a great shooter. Single action, double action type thing. And I went on YouTube and looked at a lot of my other fellow gun enthusiast channels and sorry I'm shaking so much and uh, I never found the Longhorn convertible this is called the Longhorn convertible I did find a lot of double nines and the reason I guess being is because they come with a 22 magnum cylinder nine shot cylinder and a 22 long rifle nine shot cylinder so I found a lot of stuff when I uh, when I punched in double nine high standard, I found a lot of things, but I never did find anything when I tried that Longhorn. So I guess the nine and a half inch version was called the Longhorn Convertible. I'm not really sure, but there's a lot of double nines. I guess that's the official name for the thing. And like I said, it came with a 22 Magnum uh, ma uh, you know, you know, cylinder, and it also. Um, came in a box. I have the box and everything for it, so it was a pretty cool gun, um, although it was not a very expensive gun. They sold for somewhere between like $70 and $110. This one may have been more because of the long barrel. And uh, they weren't, you know, they weren't all that expensive. I just seen a fellow shooter's uh, gun, a very nice chrome, uh, shiny version, maybe nickel, I don't know, um, that his grandfather had given him. And that's kind of what inspired me to do this one. Um, so I want you to take a good look at the Longhorn Convertible. It's got a uh, pretty primitive sights on it, but I painted them and brightened them up a little bit. And uh, like I said, it is an aluminum frame with a steel cylinder, steel barrel, of course. I have only had the 22 Magnum cylinder in it one time and fired it maybe you know, a, a cylinder full or two, maybe not even. Um, the thing I like about it is it's accurate, it shoots good. The trigger pull is pretty horrible, I have to admit. Uh, the, trigger, the trigger pull is stiff, single and action, up, single and double action. So um, it's, it doesn't have the best trigger in the world, but it does shoot good and it's accurate. Um, the other thing I like about it is it'll digest any type of 22 ammunition. That was a mix match of ammo that I had in there. I had different velocities and different things and it seems to shoot anything and I guess if it can handle a 22 Magnum. Let me get that string out of there. That's that's kind of annoying. Uh, I guess if it can handle 22 Magnum it can certainly handle any of these high velocity uh, 22. So that's it. That's my Longhorn Convertible by High Standard. I hope you enjoyed watching me shoot it and uh, I'll zoom in here one more time, maybe get you back on the tripod so you can really see this thing. Maybe just one more look. Bobby Brown, guns and drums. Keep it pointed in a safe direction, folks. It's always a good idea. Please like, please subscribe, make comments. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. And so is my dog. Act excited. Go ahead. That's a boy.